Hello and welcome to Taiwan Home Tutor. Today we'll be covering games related to the topic big and small. I'm sure to, that almost every textbook has some kind of topic related to adjectives such as big, small, long, short, and so on. Uh, therefore, it's very important to know how to teach students uh, these sort of things because uh, when you teach kindergarten is very different from elementary uh, students. Uh, everything that you teach should be uh, done by doing so students must do things so what you need to prepare is an old magazine uh, I would suggest maybe something related to traveling or animals or whatever it is uh, with different types of pictures uh, obviously this magazine will be destroyed so it should be something not very important for you uh, right and then you will prepare two boxes just normal carton boxes and you have to label the boxes so one box would be big labeled big and the other one would be labeled small all right all of this you place on the floor in front of you if you sit on a chair and in front of the class like if the students are sitting in a semicircle like that so before the class you have to cut out cut out some pictures in the magazine so some of the th things such as I don't know maybe bowl spoon a remote control should be small some of the things should be large such as uh, mountain uh, a person and they should be big and small visually so not only uh, children should understand like a mountain is big for example right obviously it should visually bigger be bigger than uh, the ball so uh, otherwise they will be confused they will take pick up the mountain and put in a box which is labeled small uh, so after that you will just put all the all the cards on the floor in front of you all of these uh, cuts out and then you will teach the words. You don't have to, I think, pay too much attention. You just need to teach it once to, to let, let students understand and see them. And you can also teach them where they should go. For example, I don't know, the ball will go into the box which is labeled small. So you can teach them that the ball is small. And the next one, the mountain is big. Uh, and so on. So you got, I think you already got the idea, right? So uh, the game is kind of sorting. Students have to come grab the the card would you say for example small so they have to find a small object and put it in the box labeled small and if you said big they will have to find something big and put it in the box labeled big and if you want to make it more interesting uh, which I do suggest give give them some kind of team names and reward them with uh, some kind of points so there will be more uh, interested and involved in class and uh, more willing to raise the hand and try it out all right so I think this is all see you uh, in the next part uh, don't forget to like uh, favorite and to share uh, information about the channel thank you bye bye guys